If you've ever ridden on an airplane, you have heard them in their little demonstration talk about the oxygen mask. And so what is it that they say? They say, in the event of emergency and a drop in cabin pressure, the oxygen mask is going to fall from the ceiling and you need to put it on yourself first before helping other passengers. And so why do they say that? It's the same reason in the plane as it is in real life. And that is, is that if the oxygen mask drops and you don't put it on yourself first and you try to help other passengers, whether it's someone else that you're riding with, a stranger, or even your child, if you're trying to help them put it on and in that process, because you're not getting oxygen, you lose consciousness. You can't help them, can you? And in the worst case scenario, if you lose consciousness and you can't help them get their mask on, and so they lose consciousness, in the worst case scenario, you would both die. So it's not a joke. And in real life, it is exactly the same way. If you were going around helping everybody else with their oxygen masks and not putting it on yourself, at some point, you're gonna burn out. You're gonna be in that place where you are unhealthy and sick and unable to help anybody else. And no one wants to get to that place, but that is where you're going if that is how you're living your life. And in reality, if you don't take care of yourself, both you and the other people in your life suffer. So ask yourself, have there been times when you did take care of yourself? Put yourself first, make those hard choices to honor yourself. What were those times? What is it that pushed you to get to that place where you were willing to stand up for yourself? And what was the positive benefit that you got out of it? So then ask yourself, what changes do you need to make so that you can start honoring yourself? What is it that you need? 